Can you imagine a world without computers? First of all, you wouldn't be able to watch this video. The video you see is displayed on a computer monitor and the video file is stored in a hard disk drive. Imagine a world without progress in electronics. This is what the world might look like if the electronics did not progress. We'll be dealing with lots of paper files, cluttered phone wires, relying on snail mails completely. With technology, people can just move information using hard disk drives or through the internet. This is how the world looks like now. We communicate much more easily with Bluetooth, text messages, etc. A tremendous impact has been made to our daily lives with the continuous progress in technology. Just 30 years back, we had a CD player, a video player, a video camera, and a TV to serve different functions. Now all of them are accommodated in one single device. But what if it didn't happen? What if technology and electronics didn't progress the way it did? A serious question to ask. Did you know that many modern developments such as YouTube, Facebook and computer graphics were possible because of progress in hard disk drives? Film director James Cameron had the concept of Avatar back in the 1990s. Do you know why it took so long to even start making the movie? The answer to that question is not the lack of a producer, but the lack of technology. One such technology was hard disk drives. The modern HDD can store 100 Blu-ray movies, about 45,000 CD quality songs, and 400,000 MP3 songs, which you can listen to for 2 million minutes, or 33,000 hours, or 1,388 days, or 4 years, continually, without listening to any of the songs more than once. The apps that you use every day, such as YouTube or Facebook, wouldn't even be possible without the progress in HDDs. YouTube has 500 hours of videos uploaded every minute. That's roughly 200 DVDs of content every single minute. Facebook has 3 million likes or 300,000 photos input into the website every minute. And Instagram has 55,000 photos uploaded every minute. All these massive amounts of data are stored in HDDs. So, coming back to Avada, why exactly couldn't the movie be made back in the 90s? This is it. The only technology that would provide cheap storage was not available back then. It took 2 petabytes of storage to can Avatar, or rather box it. 2 petabytes would have cost $300 million for the HDD alone in 1997. This is more than Avatar's total budget, which was $240 million. With 500 gigabyte hard drives in 2007, the HDD became cheaper. HDD budget was only $0.6 million. Avatar also used computers with 100 terabytes of memory, which would have cost more than several million dollars. So what discoveries allowed these technologies to progress the way they did? What's the underlying physical and material science that deals with this progress. What's in store for HDDs and electronics? All these questions and more are answered in PH4414 and PAP747.